Hi guys, Mel the Train Tutor here, and I've got a quick tip for you. And this is about putting and working out the sort of angle of slopes, yeah, for making sort of small hills, etc., to make sure your models don't fall down. Now, I'm in the process of customizing Gale Force 9's Grand Vestibule, and I was doing some planning, and I thought I'd put together this quick video showing you, you know, the actual mechanics behind it. So let's go cameras down. Oh, look at my messy desk. Get rid of my cigarettes, dirty habit, as my wife would say. Right. Okay, guys. I've got a couple of models here. Uh, Space Marine Librarian, Blood Bowl. I'm in the process of painting those up. I have my son's Redstone Manual that I got him for Christmas because he loves exploding things on Minecraft. Now, the problem we have is, yeah, we used to step hills. Yeah, which are flat, and we move our models from one level to another. But, you know, hills aren't always stepped, and they do come with slopes. So, what slope works for models? You know, at what point do these things fall over? Okay, and I've, I've done quite a few experiments in the past, so I'll, I'll quickly sum it up. Okay, using this Minecraft book, okay, I'll put it there, and basically you can take it to approximately, on a protractor, on this book to about 20 degrees, maybe a little higher, 25. That's what we're on now. Right, we are reaching the, yeah. Right, that was reaching 30. Yeah, and at that point it slid. With this one, it's got a bit more weight. It's gonna slide a bit earlier. I'm probably gonna guess early, yep, yeah, early 20s. Now what's happening there is the force of gravity in that direction and that direction and oh, this direction is overcoming the friction of the book. Okay, uh, let's try something different. Whiteboard marker. Ooh. That's got what? Because now it's got friction, it's not sliding. It'll keep tilting. And that is running at approximately 28 degrees before he starts they are 30 degrees easy but anyway sorry I digress basically you've got this sort of safe zone okay and I've drawn it up for you from my planning okay and this is my planning for my hill project now I don't know how clearly you can see that but basically my polystyrene over here is an inch and a quarter thick okay and based on a 20 to 5 degree angle it needs to be two and three quarters long so i'll make it three inches yeah just to flatten it out a bit more but just to sum up the ideal slope okay for for a sloped hill that miniatures can stand on okay is 20 to 25 degrees a maximum of 30 okay now the simple guide to this is really really simple yeah 20 degrees give or take a degree yeah is for every inch up yeah it's got to go three inches across so a three in one gradient so as long as you remember three in one your model should stand on them you know perfectly fine as long as they're not top heavy okay now obviously you've seen them slip on here but this is because this is completely smooth remember your war games hills are going to have what's called texture on them so they will grip a lot better and then it simply comes down to the point where your models tip over so to speak if you are concerned you're building something and you're investing a lot of time in it trial it first okay get some of the models you expect to see on it and you know lift up that side you know, get an angle for them. And if you need to make it four in one, then make it four in one just to be safe, yeah? But, the camera's up. But guys, that's basically how you work out, you know, the angles for models on sloped hills. And I'm talking specifically 28 millimeter here, uh, the heroic, as they're called. You know what I'm talking about. But anyway, dead simple. Go for three in one as a general guide. And if you're a bit worried, yeah, Go a little bit more and go four on one or run a test yourself. Remember, 20 to 25 degrees is the sweet zone, 30 max. If you put do anything more than 30, you bust. It's Mount Tumble Down, guys. Anyway, I've got to crack on with this. You have a good day, yeah? Catch you later. Ta-ra, guys.